The owners of McBride's pointed this out to us. They say that this mark was created by an accident that happened back in August. And this one right next to it is a reminder of what happened here Wednesday afternoon. According to PennDOT, between 2011 and 2015, there have been 11 accidents on this stretch of Route 8, which is less than a mile. The owners here say something needs to be done and they know what it is. One by one, Knock High School students returned to the spot where one of their friends took his last breath. We gather here today to uh, remember someone that was uh, very special to us. That someone special was 16-year-old Cameron Ashton. He always had a smile on his face. He was a great kid, you know, he was able to make anybody laugh. And to have someone go so young and that was so special to everyone, we, we just can't even, like, it, it doesn't seem real. Cameron's friend was driving them home from Butler Votech Wednesday afternoon. Penn Township police say the Jeep rolled over on State Route 8 and crashed into the side of McBride Station Bar and Grill. His friend walked away from the accident. Cameron was ejected and died shortly after. The owners of the bar say they heard what happened and saw this out of their window. I saw a 16-year-old boy die. I saw a 16-year-old boy take his last breath on my property. And it, just, it needs to stop. Serena Skelly blames the drainage along Route 8 in this washed out spot. Because it keeps catching everybody's wheels and bringing them right into my building. For a 16 year old just to lose his life. And Cameron's friends want to do something in memory of him here. They're thinking a cross surrounded by some flowers. The owners of McBride are okay with that. They just want to make sure that it's off of the road for everyone's safety. Reporting in Penn Township, Alyssa Raymond, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.